What's happening, gamers? It's Amber here with Kaylin's Let's Plays. Hope you guys are all having a great day today. Today we're going to be doing some more um, Disney Dreamlight Valley on the PS5. And I hope you guys are all doing well. Um, and today we're going to be doing some quests with Eve from Wally. So good to see you guys in the chat. Hi, PJ. Hi, SSJ. Uh, Cody. Hi, Jacob Langlet. Hi, everyone. All right. So um, we're going to hang out with Eve a little bit, do a few quests here. Oh, I forgot we had Scrooge McDuck quests to do, but you know what? We're going to do Eve quests instead. Oh, we have to get Eve to a level 7. That's okay. Um, we'll, we'll hang out with her for a bit. Uh, let's go see where she is, actually. Is she here or is she somewhere else? Oh, we can try to do some quests with other people while we level Eve up. Um, I just felt like hanging out with her today because we finished her little garden thing. And it looks like Eve might not even be here. Oh, you enjoyed prom yesterday? Awesome, Brandon. That's fantastic. I started playing Disney Mirrorverse on my phone. Awesome. Uh, very cool, uh, PJ. Hi, said Y. Hi, BSF. Hi, Princess Emmy. Hi, Rudy the Shiny Hunter. Hi, William. Hi, everyone. Hope you guys are all doing well. Alright, so we're gonna go see if we can find Eve. Alright, looks like she's actually at her house, so... So let's go say hello and see if she's at home. <laughs> Hi, Game Wing One. How's it going? Hope you're having a great day. Good to see you, Game Wing, and everyone else. Hi, PJ. Lunar Landing and Rudy. You're making a super world in Mario 2 Maker, and it is hard. Awesome, Rudy the Shiny Hunter. Hi, Marissa. Hi, um, everyone. Hi, said why. Hi, Brandon. Hi, William. So we had a... Um, Oh, okay, let's hang out. Directive. Okay. Okay, so this is Eve's um, house. And it looks really cute. You can actually see the stars outside her window. So super cute. And you've got, like, probably places to get, like, space food here. And everything looks all, like, sci-fi. Very cool. I like how futuristic it looks. You bop to the music. Awesome. Um, yeah, my inventory is usually full when I start my streams. I usually have to um, get stuff out of my inventory. Alright, so we're hanging out with uh, Eve. I'm sorry that something terrible happened. I'm sorry to hear that. Um, I hope your day gets better. I'll definitely keep you in my thoughts and prayers. I'm so sorry about that. Sorry to hear that. This place really shows that everybody's in their own way. I 
All right, so we're gonna just uh, put some stuff away here. Um, as usual, I uh, collect things all over the valley, so it um, takes me just a minute to put everything away. Okay, that looks good. All right, we'll put those eggs away and, um... All right, so as you guys can see, I've got color-coordinated uh, bins for everything. Oops. So apparently that one's full. So once I get 5,000 more Dreamlight, I can make another large bin and that will help me out a lot. Alright, so it will take me just a second to put all this stuff away here. Got chili peppers and oregano and um, got soy. Oh, we can actually sell some of this soy uh, if we want to. Hi, Eve. So... Eve and I are just going to hang out. Hopefully we can get her level up. Um, she's actually, I made her uh, a time bender. So, you know, you can make people a gardener or uh, all kinds of different things. And um, you can make them a miner. You can make them a gatherer. So I made her a time bender. All right, so this is all our extra food that we don't need. Oregano can go in there, and I guess we'll go dream fruit in there, too. All right, so now we have a lot more room than we had before in our pockets here. So we're just going to kind of hang out with Eve and we're going to do some uh, different quests and things like that. I guess I'm just going to put these extra things in here. I'm going to keep this. That's really important, that core. So I'll just put those extra flowers in there. All right, now I think we're good. All right, so let's go find a Scrooge McDuck and we can try to do one of his quests because I think we still had some quests to do for him. Alright, he is all the way down at the beach, so I guess we can just run after him. Oh, hi, Later Gator. Okay. Oh, thank you for um, uh, messaging me the custom characters. Appreciate that so much. Thank you. So let's go find uh, Scrooge McDuck. Oh, he's all the way down there. Okay, Eve, let's go see what he has to say. Okay, oh, Wing. Oh, uh, I made another dis discovery. You got time for another tip about automating the island. Let's hear it, Scrooge. You must remember how I was telling you the isle used to be home for all sorts of ancient machines. I managed to learn about one. It's some sort of machine that gardens for you. 
Um, no way. Why, it's quite remarkable. Reminds me of the sorts of things my dear friend Gyro builds. There's just one problem. I don't know where you're going to find all the ancient parts to build it. Ancient parts? That's the sort of thing I'm always finding with my hourglass. Ah, oh, well, then why don't you take the ancient blueprints and see what you can do with them? Um, it looks like I should have no problem finding all of the stuff and building an ancient gardener. I'll get to work. Hi, and if it's it's not gardening you're interested in, you can always make another kind of ancient machine. <laughs> the potential here is grand. I want to see what you can do. Thank you kindly. All right, so we are going to track this quest. Build any ancient machine on the time-bending table. Search for the right parts using your hourglass. So, um, we actually, um, Eve is actually, I made her an hourglass bending person. So, this is actually going to be really easy. We're going to use our hourglass here. And if you guys don't have the hourglass, you get it from doing the Eternity Isle DLC, so... shows that everybody's special in their own way. All right, thank you for that, Mirabelle. Um... I don't know. I don't think that... Well, I mean, they could add Star Wars. I don't know. I don't know if they will. I don't know if they'll have the rights to that. Um, I think they're just using older characters. I could be wrong, but... Um. Okay, um, so let's go see our ancient time-bending table. I don't know if we have a time-bending... I think we have to go to Eternity Isle for that. So maybe we'll go um, check out Eternity Isle. I mean, eh, con conceivably, I mean, I guess Star, uh, Star Wars is owned by Disney conceivable that they could add it in. Yes, a new member. <laughs> oh. oh, wow. Thank you so much, um, Isaiah. Sorry I've been away from the streams. The flat bedding gig didn't work out. I've been busy job hunting. I'll be here and there on streams till I find another trucking job. I'm so sorry to hear that. I'll, uh, thank you, Isaiah, for, uh, I appreciate that. I wonder if anyone here has a gizmo or a thingamabob. Um, thank you, Isaiah, for all of your kindness and, and, and um, support for the channel. And, and I really appreciate it so much. Thank you so much. Um, I'll be uh, praying that you find a, another job, uh, a better uh, trucking job. Definitely. Yeah, I kind of, uh, kind of had a not, not that much of a disappointment, but a kind of a minor disappointment today. I kind of wanted to be part of this praise team thing, but they never called me back. And then I noticed some, like, kid that, like, never even, tr has ever even done, uh, like, music before. He was, like, 
I want to try out the drums. They had him. I have, like, literally a degree in music, but they didn't even call me or anything. But, no, nah, life is kind of frustrating sometimes. You, you think, like, oh, I'm really going to get this important thing, and then you don't get it. And it's frustrating, definitely. <sighs> All right, so um, I'm just going to try to put as many of this, these things back as possible. All right. Okay. I hope the storm doesn't get too bad. Uh, hopefully not, Ariel. All right, so we are just going to go all the way over to Eternity Isle. Yeah, definitely. I passed everything. It's just the flat footing really scared me at the end. It's really dangerous. Oh, I understand. I understand that. That is dangerous. Mm. I don't want you to do something. Wonder where my dangerous. rain boots are. Um. Yeah, exactly, Isaiah. I I want you to be safe. I don't want you to do something that's dangerous. Definitely. Yeah. Don't do it if it makes you feel um like there's something wrong. Like. Yeah, exactly. I mean, there is a lot. I don't know that much about trucking, but I know it can be very dangerous. The icy roads and being stuck there out in the middle of the road. Who knows what's going to happen? Exactly. Yep. There's a lot of there's a lot of dangers. I don't know why this is. All right. Well, I guess it wants me to do this first. So we're going to try to collect some things here, and then we're going to see on our time bending table what we can build. Well, it's good to see you again, Isaiah, and always great to see you, and uh, I hope you're doing all right today. Yeah, I, I try not to really, I have a lot of things on my mind, but I try not to talk about my personal stuff as much because I have a lot of uh, you know, obviously people attacking my channel, and, and then if I talk about my personal stuff, then they'll be like, aha, she's worried about this. <laughs> so more stuff people can use against me, so I always end up just kind of, you know, stopping myself. <laughs> um, but yeah, um, uh, we, we just had a house inspection, it was very frustrating, and, um, we, if you guys haven't seen our house tour, we... We did that. I'm hoping that um, uh, my family, when they come up there, they might be coming up here in June um, to see. We, they have to go to a funeral thing, and maybe some of my family will actually want to visit my house or stay over because um, I have a really nice area downstairs. I actually got a bed frame, a very, like the cheapest bed frame I could find on layaway. And the cheapest mattress I could find, uh, and and uh, like I'm, I'll be paying it off for like a year and a half, uh, so my family can hopefully stay over. And I'm hoping my my brother and his kids, or my dad, or my other brother can stay the night. Um, when they come by, then they won't have to pay for a hotel or something. So. That would be nice. I hope that I can do that. But we'll see what happens. Uh, but yeah, this uh, today I uh, was so relieved from actually doing the... the Having to kind of like a scrub. We had to scrub our whole house like, you know, just top to bottom. And um, I, literally my arms hurt. Um, and... You know, they just kind of were like, oh, okay, I guess it's acceptable. So I literally just made it, like, immaculately clean. Um, and it's just kind of acceptable. So I'm, I'm at the point where I'm probably going to start, like, get r getting rid of all my stuff. Like, as much stuff as I can so that I can try to live like a minimalist. 
So when they come in next time, like, there would be nothing that they can say at all. Um, but we'll see. I'm, I'm kind of, I'm, I'm, yeah, I don't know. I, I kind of freak out in those kind of moments, but, um, but yeah, um, basically after they were gone, I decided to make today, well, I had some ingredients in the fridge from before they came. And um, Luke did a great job. He actually cleaned out the whole fridge with hot water. So he just scrubbed it clean with hot water. And he didn't have to use any chemicals. So um, that was really amazing. I was really impressed by that. And uh, so basically I had some carrots and broccoli in the fridge and eggs. So I made carrot and broccoli and egg like quiche. And I had leftover um, egg mixture, because I had eggs and milk and broccoli and carrots. And I had leftover mixture, and I put it in little, like, uh, muffin help. cups. So I'll have lots. So we've got lots of carrot and broccoli eggs and cheese. So I'm going to see if Luke likes that, because if he likes that, I think that is a, um, a go recipe. Like, I'm, like, testing out recipes on Luke for my future kids, because... Luke, I don't want to say Luke has the palate of a kid, but he doesn't like fancy things. He likes simple, he likes hot dogs, you know, mac and cheese. So, I don't want to say he likes the things a kid would like, but, um, <laughs> so, yeah. So, I'm testing. I'm using him as a guinea pig. So, Mr. Scrooge would like us to make one of these. So we're going to need, oh, we almost have enough mist. We need basic ancient cooker, ancient, okay. Why does it say, it says, sir, build any ancient machine. Oh, I need two ancient cores for this. Okay, let's see if we have any other ancient cores. Maybe we have them in here. Oh, doesn't look like I have that. All right, so I guess we're going to keep going and trying to find um, things that we need to make uh, these. We just need about, like, I don't know, 100 more Dreamlight or something. I kind of miscalculated there. Oh, if they included Tron in Dreamlight Valley? That would be cool, said. So I'm going to go back to the table, and we're going to see if, uh, if there's anything else. Let's see if there's anything else we need. We need another ancient core. So we have, we have everything but an ancient core. All right, I'm going to see what we need to do to find an ancient core. Let's go, let's go see what we need to do. Because I would like to finish this if I could. The bigger the rift, the bit better chance of getting a, a core. Okay, thank you, um, thank you, the eyes. I don't quite know what that means, the bigger the rift.
right. Well, it's saying on a website here that I'm looking at, you can more easily find ancient cores in Dreamlight Valley. Um, well, I guess we'll... This place really shows that everybody... We'll keep looking for ancient place. cores here. I don't know if we're going to find any here. That definitely was not an ancient core. Alright, well I guess we're still looking for ancient cores then. Well, we leveled Eve up. That was kind of what we wanted to do. So we got another thing. All right, let's see our inventory. How many agent cores do we have? Just the one. Just have the one. Oh, and there was our last quest. There's a little Eve and Wally, which is super cute. Alright, so it looks like we found everything in this area. So what does it mean by the bigger the rift, the more chance you'll find an ancient core? Is that like these little things? Are they considered rifts or... Um, yeah, let me know the eyes or anyone else. Are, are those the little swirling sands of time rifts? Oh my gosh more of this. Literally, I don't know why. Uh, why did that just happen to me? I guess I didn't press that quickly enough. Wow, okay. Well, I guess we can go back to Dreamlight Valley and look for an ancient core. <laughs> Alright, we found everything in there. With the hourglass, the bigger the hole, the better chance of getting the core. Okay, thank you, the eyes. I appreciate that very much. Thank you for letting me know. All right, let's try to go here and get whatever this is. So I guess we can, uh, we'll just keep hanging out looking for an ancient core. Um, I don't know why it won't allow, oh, this is not a, that kind of orb. I think that, that orb is to open this door. I keep thinking that's one of those orbs. Well, 
I don't know, guys, if I'm gonna find this today. I'm thinking I should give up and do a different quest. Whoops. At least we're getting a lot of, uh, missed... missed points. Almost 5,000! So, uh, if you guys didn't know, Luke is actually going to do the Sandland demo today. So that should be pretty exciting. I guess we're just leveling Eve up today. Maybe we'll be able to do some other quests today as well. Well, we got a lot of uh, materials, but we just don't have an ancient core. Well, I guess we can go in the sand area and see if we can find one over there. Literally, like... Okay, Eve. Let's go see what we can do. I really thought we were going to have more quests for Eve, but I guess not. I have so many amazing neighbors. Oh, I think because we upgraded our hourglass, we can finally get these swirling vortexes of doom over here. I guess we'll search this area. Show me ancient core. Let's go. Why would I drop that? Got a random potion. Well, I don't know what to say. I really don't know what to say. I don't see any ancient cores around here. I guess... I'm not going to find one today. Super frustrating. Maybe there's another quest we can do that's more exciting because it's not letting me do that. Um, craft and use the following. Large pickaxe potion. Large rubble shovel. Large glass stalagmite. Um, large evil plant watering can potion. Well, we can do some of, uh, why don't we do a Merlin quest then? Because I think we got a lot of stuff from the time bending thing. So, this place is we might as well pick this up. Let's see what this is. We got a uh, new memory. And Mirabelle, I'm not done with her quest because I don't know how to feed a raccoon very well. LeFou, adjusting to Gastonia. I'm trying to be considerate, going through my coconuts at an alarming rate. <laughs> All right, so let's actually go all the way. I'm just going to morph back. It's morphing time. There might be some in Dreamlight Valley. Thank you, um, the eyes. Yeah, there probably is. Um, I'll have to grind. So I'll have to grind later with, um, with Eve. Oh, bunch. 
We're going to have to do a lot of grinding with Eve. Yeah, definitely. Yep. Um, better to to watch the movie and then see what you think about it based on it, what you what you actually saw versus the the critics' opinion of it. Definitely, I agree with that. Definitely, um, Tim and um, um and Game Wing and everyone. Hi, Sammy Bear. All right. All right, so let's actually see. Um, I think these are things that Merlin really wanted us to do. So let's actually see what his quests were. Large copper pickaxe potion. Large rubble shovel potion. Large glass stalagmite pickaxe. Large copper rocks potion. Large rubble shovel. I don't really know what all these do. Large glass stalagmite pickaxe. Evil plant watering can. Um, so I don't really know which one is best to do. Alright, so let's try the large evil plant watering can, even though this probably is probably the least bit useful. I'm a sucker for punishment. Let's just use our ancient core and waste it on this. <laughs> and then I will have plenty of time to upgrade everything else later. Okay, so we got our large evil plant watering can. So now we should be able to water things that we weren't able to water before. Let's go to the grasslands and let's see if there's anything we can water. Some large evil plants. Okay. Alright, so there were some big plants here I could not water before uh, last time. Alright, I think these are them. So we can finally get rid of some of these huge plants. Well, this was anticlimactic. I feel like that should have been more exciting. Well, that really should have been more exciting, but you know what? It's better than nothing. So we can all water these huge plants now. So we are progressing a little bit. We did one more thing off of Merlin's to-do list. We still have to do Scrooge. Oh wait, here's the ones. Here's the big ones. That's what we're talking about. Those are the huge plants. Okay, now we now we're cooking with gas. Now we're, we're cooking with gas there. Okay. Um. Good. 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 Okay. Alright, so those are the huge plants. So now when those huge plants sprout up, we can actually get rid of them. Which is really cool, actually. So, we couldn't do that before. So we upgraded our watering can. Uh, we made progress, so. And, um, I'm sorry, but, uh, I have to go get Luke up. And, yeah, uh... Yeah, guys, the uh, the eyes is really trying to help me out to, uh, you know, just try to, uh, you know, like if if uh, basically my 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 feeling is like if an argument kind of goes back for, for back and forth more than one or two times, you know, try to just let it go because everybody else kind of wants to just enjoy the stream. But we appreciate you all being here. I appreciate everyone being here and. I understand you guys have strong opinions, but, you know, just try to, um, you know, I, I care about all of you guys. I appreciate all of you guys. So, you know, um, I, I appreciate everyone here. So thank you very much. Okay. So, um, thank you, the eyes for trying to help me out there. Okay, guys. Um, 
So this was a very short stream. I do apologize for that. And um, I'm going to go get Luke up and we're going to try to get on to our next stream, which is uh, Ace Attorney in just a few minutes. Um, thanks so much for watching everyone and, um, uh, and uh, I will see you guys in about, um, uh, like 10 minutes or so for the next stream on Ace Attorney. Thanks again, guys and gals for watching and, um, we'll see you guys on the next stream. God bless. Happy gaming. See ya. And thanks again for the highlighted message today. See you guys on the next stream.